Welcome back everyone to another exciting episode of Chemical React. It's -a me, Fusion Form. And over there, like always, my co-host Gorilla Fist. How's it going? On today we have So I'm a Spider, So What, episode eight. Alright. <sighs> big things happened in the last episode. That big reveal big of the things? elf. Uh well yeah, remember, remember the elf teacher draining all the skills and ability of the basically the bad guy? <laughs> and that's crazy. kinda yeah. Oh. Crazy, Ooh. but like with the uh -huh. ending, with the uh, with the spider girl about the evil eye and how she basically just called it, and it just some guy programmed her, and so now it's like, is this a video game? <laughs> is this the Matrix? <laughs> so many questions that need answers to that we don't have answers to, or at least some people don't have answers to. Yeah, and then I don't know. What do you think is gonna happen with the uh, with the humans? And uh, they, uh, I honestly, I, I, they have to meet up with main Spider Girl eventually, right? Yeah, I just don't know if it's gonna be like you know, final episode and it's a fight. Like, wait, we're friends and you know, peace treaty, or it's just gonna be like, I sense if you know, I sense, I sense something, I, you know. I think Faye will probably be the one that notices. And she'll probably be like, I'm sorry, I don't want to fight anymore type of scenario, right? It, that's that's if they fight. I'm saying like, they she oh, might just fight. know. Well, you don't know that. Oh, she's going to fight. No, you don't know that. It is, watch. I, I haven't, uh, by the way, I haven't really <laughs> read the manga up to this point or anything, but I'm going to make a prediction, but I'm pretty sure that he's going to look at uh, Spider-Girl and see that taboo. And it's going to basically, you know, think about the, uh, the religious Zelia, you know, crazy girl. Uh, I don't and then know she's about like, that. I got a fighter. She's got taboo. Taboo is bad, but you know, I'm also taboo. But anyway, I don't, know, I, don't know. I don't think that's how. I don't think that's how that's gonna go. I don't know. Have you read it? Uh, I mean, I don't. I mean, you know, I've read the manga, but I don't know anything about what the humans are gonna do. Oh yeah, that's true. Well, it's a surprise, I guess. <laughs> All right, so, well, uh, yeah, we'll have to wait and see. Yeah. So before we start, if you enjoy reacting to this episode, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. Also, come join our Discord, Twitter, and Patreon if you want to stay up to date or get access to our live reaction footage to this series and many more. And without further ado, Fusion, I got my fingers up. And three, two, one, go. He is so out of it. Oh yeah, because he, he witnessed that whole, what we were talking about in the intro. <laughs> <laughs> Such a weird statement to be making. <laughs> was that really was necessary? That? <laughs> was that, were they trying to make her like cute? I don't know. <laughs> is this back in their original world? No, it is. Yep. Oh, I could see the teacher in human form. That's oh. pretty cute. She looks exactly like her elf form. <laughs> Man, man, during high school, I would have loved to go to the park. <laughs> Jesus, what? It's crazy. Is that the zealous girl? I thought it was his uh his friend that was a boy. Like, that was a boy. In no, his that's life. no, that's the redhead. Okay, my bad. That's the one sitting next to him on the right. I'm pretty sure we'll figure it out. Give me anything, a cross, a Bible. No, that's not gonna work because remember she changed in the other world. I know, but I'm talking about in this human form. I don't know what the, I think religion's different. It's not Christianity, Catholic, but you know what I'm getting at, right? Any religious relic that I give to Right, but she wasn't religious in the normal world. No, there's always the things like, I, I don't care what I want to drink, just give me something. And we're, we're like, and you know what I want. <laughs> <laughs> I wonder if we're going to see uh, Spider-Girl in human form. We did. She was the one reading the book. At least behind the tree. Who's this? <sighs> Looks like he's having a bad day. Well, there's Faye. Mm -hmm. She kind of looks like a gravity girl. <laughs> oh my God, she does. <laughs> Oh my oh, god. 
She's got a crush on him. <laughs> I'm assuming that's what it meant. I'm not talking about the spider, but I'm talking about the, the bully thing. I think they both do. Yeah. I know, but I had to clarify that. Yeah, that's probably a good idea. <laughs> what? I missed it. What did it say? Paris Simon Juice? I'm not sure. What if it's some, what if it's some in weird way, right? Mm -hmm. Like the teacher was like Seto Kaiba with the, you know, the virtual capsule thing. And that's how she, this is all a test. <laughs> What? Wouldn't what that, would that be a twist? Be weird? <laughs> because, you know, I, I'm still going off the whole little video game program, you know. But damn, that'd be a good twist. What? Okay. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, it's out of there. Something's up with the elf teacher. Okay, relax, Spider Girl. Okay. That just reminds you of uh, DMC. For those that don't know, that's Detroit Metal City. Check it out. You won't regret it. <laughs> oh my god. Too much energy involved. Man, those personalities are gonna go way out of control. You have no idea. Man, I could barely hear under one. That's too much text. Yeah, I'm trying to read it quick. Celestial power. Damn. He's practically like Galactics. Damn. <laughs> Who are you gonna unleash? Satan? <laughs> well, obviously, they have a demon, but... mind of its own. Yep, that's the most logical reasoning. Yep. <laughs> Where'd the hat come from? Wait a minute. I don't even know, dude. Oh no. Oh no, oh, there's a more. third one. So we have the intelligent strategic one, the magic one, and the fighting one. It's almost like... It reminds me of this movie, I I'm trying to remember, I think it's called Splice? Mm. I don't remember. It's the, uh, it had Bruce Willis, it had, uh, it had, uh... God dang. Who was that one guy that was on the plane? He's like, I hate my Samuel Jackson. Oh. Something's angry. What's in there? Oh, dead bodies. Uh, yeah, you know, typical, yeah. typical dungeons. Mm-hmm. Yeah, we're not going in there. And lava. Oh. Oh, lava dragon. Oh. Come oh. on, man. Why are you gonna give me all this tech and you know I'm not text and I'm not gonna read it? Wait, it's hurt. It's like a half dead lava zombie. Actually, no. Yeah. Wait, what? But his ribcage is exposed with his bones. His eyes, though. What is she gonna do? Magic. I hear the I hear the music kicking. <laughs> She's just pulling out all the magic uh, tricks. <laughs> That's what we've been waiting for—the full power. <laughs> oh. That's an interesting looking dragon. It doesn't have legs. It's more like a like a snake. Sure hybrid. doesn't. That evil eye. <laughs> That's so weird. She dodging. You can't kill. Move. You can't kill what you can't hit. What? What? Ah. What? She, she, she was able to stop that? Uh, uh what? <laughs> I guess making I mean, a poison... I don't even know that. I mean, it, it put her out earlier, so... I guess I'm under the assumption that anything that's venomous is flammable, but... I am also was under but that assumption I don't, I don't, until I, I put out fire. I don't know if that's true or not. Let me know in the comments. <laughs> you fell into my plan! Acceleration! <laughs> oh man. <laughs> These broken abilities, dude. Ah, <laughs> uh, nothing like Isekai with broken main characters. 
Ultra Mega oh, okay. Mega Max. <laughs> <laughs> oh man. What? It, it, oh, it got bigger. <laughs> sure it did. Oh, oh no. Level four. Remember that. That's funny. Um, he said, nah, I don't think fair. it worked. <laughs> I'm telling you, go for that rib cage. Oh, the eyes. Is it... Hmm. Yes. And it's time to make your own terrain. All the stuff she can use will catch on fire. I know. But still, it's something, it's an idea. Let me guess, what? spider web is let me guess, spider spider web is fire resistance. What? But she's, she's lying. What? Alright, so Yes. Does she does she actually think she's dead or is she lying? I think she knows she's alive, but I don't think I think she's gonna have a hard time explaining it to everybody that she's a spider and why phase a earthworm. Yeah, but like they don't know if they have the taboo and like they can just look at her and see her stats. And you know, I don't think they have the check face that. I mean, I know the blue hair guy checked face that, but he never looked into the uh the titles, you know. I don't know. I think she might not actually know. And who knows? Um, but on the bigger knows, or she that dragon. She could be lying and telling the truth in a sense that you know, uh, the human form died. You know what I mean? Oh, like oh, a half true half life type yeah. of thing. Yeah, and yeah. Like, she's you know dead, but she, her as to what she is now is a lie. Ah, uh, that's, that's a good. That'd be a good clickbait. <laughs> <laughs> Elf girl clickbait. Okay. <laughs> but um, but that dragon she's fighting or whatever the thing is, it's hurt. Why is it hurt? If from the look from the body and the carcasses, it looked like it took on a war or a bunch of creatures. Well, if the opening indicates anything, there's a bigger dragon down here. Yeah, I was about to say, or it could be the other dragon that we saw that probably beat this one up and then left that made that big hole in the, hole, in, the in the sky. Mm-hmm. This is my assumption again. That'd be, that's probably a pretty good, pretty good assumption. I mean, it but, only uh, makes sense. <laughs> I mean, if there's a big hole that goes down and it, I don't know, I don't know. <sighs> right. So, did you enjoy the episode? Yeah, I enjoyed it. This I episode, like it. This show's oh. always pretty good. I like it. I'm Actually, I'm starting to like. Oh man, those personalities. Oof. Uh, They're starting to get to me I now. Don't rem I don't remember that fourth one that came in. So that's going to be interesting. The, um, I have to say, I, I've, I think this might be the slowest episode for me, even though this is the most, probably a lot, a lot of action. I don't know. Cause for, I don't know, for me personally, I didn't like the whole personalities. I felt like we wasted way too much time focused on the personalities, but I understand like each personality was made specifically for a situation hence the magic one, hence the strategic one, hence whatever another one that comes in. But, but don't worry. Like, that, but you, I, don't know. I guess talk. I guess I guess I want to focus more on her and her dealing everything around rather than her taking time like five minutes or a minute to think in her head about what these oh, other don't personality. Worry. Ah, don't worry. You'll get what you want later on. I hope so because the only person that I'm willing to listen to with another personality in his head is Deadpool. Okay. <laughs> I think that wraps it up. And like always, guys, you see you in the next episode.